In, in our in our uh, development from from the beginning, uh, when we are unborn yet, we start out as embryos, go to fetal status, and then we are born after nine months of gestation. And in the beginning, we start out with with stem cells, embryonic stem cells. Later on, it's a diversification. So the stem cells diversify. They know they will uh, get uh, heart, they will get liver, they get, will get brain, uh, whatever. And uh, if we have, if when we are born, we still have quite a quite a few active ones. But uh, the older we get, the more they are shut down. And uh, we now know from research that there are still some uh, hidden. Uh, stem cells in, in the liver, in the bone marrow, uh, even in the brain they found it, but they are not able to uh, re be reactivated. With a cell therapy we could show that even uh, body's own stem cells can uh, be regenerated, so uh, our cell therapy helps the body uh, re actually reactivate uh, uh, organ-specific stem cells to help repair their own organs. We started out with the cell therapy in 1976. Uh, in patients we are doing that since 1982 and uh, since that time we did thousands and thousands of patients from all over the world. older we get, uh, the sicker we get, the degenerative uh, uh, diseases come, uh, it depends on environmental, environmental causes, toxins, our lifestyle, uh, whatever, and uh, the um, cell therapy is repairing. It's not, uh, what would we say, rejuvenation, uh, it's, it repairs uh, what can be repaired. Uh, that means um, if, you, if your gene subset allows you to um, be 100 years old, and uh, we normally we do from the beginning everything again so that, that we don't get that old uh, through our lifestyle. And uh, with a cell therapy we can uh, partially um, uh, rebuild, regenerate re uh, uh, those defects and for example heart, uh, heart diseases or kidney diseases or especially or liver diseases. We can, we can boost the normal activity of healthy cells and uh, get the body to repair, help repair itself. Cell therapy has been uh, proven that it works and it helps uh, to uh, treat uh, millions of people over the last almost 50, 80, 80 years uh, worldwide, uh, especially uh, Parkinson's uh, and multiple sclerosis, even Alzheimer's, and we treat cancer patients. We have uh, um, Down syndrome. We have uh, chronic, chronic infectious diseases like Crohn's disease, like uh, colitis ulcerosa, uh, and a, a lot more, which can be uh, treated with cell therapy, uh, successful treated with cell therapy. Uh, cell therapy can um, repair mutated DNA of um, defect cells if they are chronic inf uh, infectious or if they, are, if they are cancer cells. In some cases they even can reverse uh, cells which are, going, are just on the brink to, to, to being cancer cells. What I want definitely to stress is the, uh, the possibility uh, if uh, what we are often asked can uh, cell therapy can that harm people. Uh, no because uh, that the, the time where we are collecting those cells is uh, in the embryonic or ear early fetal stage, which means that you have organ specificity, that it means uh, the cells know where they should go to, what, where, where they belong to, and what they sh uh, are going to be, uh, in, uh, brain cells, heart cells, kidney cells, liver cells, but they don't know to whom they belong yet. So if they belong to sheep or belong to, 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 to humans, uh, that's why we don't have, in the, in the, since 1982, since we treat patients, we have never any rejection about uh, the, the cell therapy. I think the cell therapy is uh, the, the, it will be the gold standard in the future, in, in, in my, my opinion, uh, uh, because uh, we are treating not symptoms but causes with the cell therapy and uh, the treating only symptoms will uh, definitely lead in the wrong way it makes people 
only uh, get sicker because we are not we are not uh, a mach machines where we where we uh, have spare parts put out put in but we have always to see the people uh, the, 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 as a human being, as a, uh, a biosystem, as a whole. So we have to take the individual and not, uh, we don't treat uh, a Crohn's disease or whatever, but we treat a, a, a person with his own uh, biography, with his own background, and we uh, look at it what we can repair or help repair there. So uh, we are just uh, treating causes and not symptoms. Awesome. Thank you very much.